start loading the bins and uh, see how much squash we have. guys doing good hands are filling up ah oh, it's been filling up good it's awesome this is looking good. There you go. George threw a melon at Ruthie and she wasn't looking. She didn't like that too well. Alright. I'm gonna haul it back. Let's go get another coat. On. You guys are doing good. Get it. Get underneath it. Push it over your heads. Push it over your heads. Push it over your heads. Who lucky that? Oh, we can't do it. We can't do it. Stop. Go to your corner, Curtis. Can't never did anything. Hey, put the strap on it, guys. Okay. I'm going home now. We're going to take this down there. You're going to pick three more bins, and then we'll go eat lunch. Just kidding. <laughs> hey, hook that strap on, guys. Hey, check on. Well, it's day two of fall break, and we're getting ready to harvest a lot more squash, so come along with us. So today we we have a lot on our tap, or on schedule for today. We got a lot going on, we need to finish up the truck. As we started looking into the truck, a lot more stuff was wrong than we thought. We're messing with the AC, also the brackets of the power steering pump. Anyway, the tractor, I need to change the 
ignition on it. this morning guys. I think the kids want to get it done. It's a pain in the rear to get through this because all the sunflowers and everything. Getting into the thickest part of all this really the sunflowers are extremely thick right here. bit here. Hopefully it'll fill this coat. Probably have too much, honestly. Oh, George is doing good. I would have helped if I would have lowered the bucket for him. George is tough. Welcome to the Wellhelm Way. So we have finished the harvest of the sellable. These are all the sellable uh, uh, squash. Last year we had, I think it was six bins or seven bins of, uh, of spaghetti squash. And we had, I think we had a total of 12 bins last year. And we had butternut and spaghetti. This year, we even had a bigger field and it was only half or less than half. So I'm kind of disappointed, but also it's a great learning tool. We'll still make our money back. We'll, we'll break even probably on everything, but uh, this was a good harvest. It didn't take us near as long to pick it this year because these kids know what the heck they're doing now. Huh, guys? Yeah. <laughs> and so, was it hard? Yeah. Uh, yeah, it hurt your back. Weeds were a pain, weren't they? Yeah. We're not going to have the weeds again. Yeah. We're going to take care of that problem. My hands are covered in scratches. Red dots all over our legs and stuff. Look at my yeah, tore, tore you up, huh? Yeah. All right. I my shirt sometimes. I have a bunch of red dots everywhere. I don't think I have any red dots. 
but it's kind of cool though it's still this is good this is really good stuff we haven't eaten too much of it this year huh we can take some home and eat it <laughs> the butternut squash and it was in a pumpkin pie last night so. oh man is yeah, it good I only like squash Mom and made pumpkin you one. Pies. Uh, so i didn't try it yet so i only like squash and pumpkin pies and paint yeah hey guys good job you were awesome today We've already picked those three totes, so yesterday we, uh, picking it and putting it in the rows is what takes longer, huh? Yes. But you guys did awesome. This was my crew did this year. This is it. This is all who helped and did all this work. Last year we had way more help. Nana and Papa and the Parsons came and Mama and we had Z over here and... Curtis. Curtis is right there. I mean, Andy. Andy. Yeah, we had a lot more crew but this year it went faster because uh, we know how what we're doing now huh mm -hmm. hey good job Thank you. well guys did a great job awesome.